Hello YouTube. I'm doing this video in uh, response to the YouTube channel Halftime Oranges for making the suggestion that I should do a video about how these shower heads work. I'm not really sure how they work, so we're going to find out today. Right here, the Hydrojet shower head. Now, another question I was asked, is this plate steel or stainless? Well, let's find out. Perfect. Got the plate. Here's my fridge magnet. We're just going to see here. This is it's steel. Okay. We don't need those anymore. Now I'll put this up for contrast so we can see the uh, spray that's coming out of the shower head. As you can see, it's going in a spiral fashion. Some say it might be the fan in the back. Some say it might be the plate. Well, let's find out. Let's take this front off. Set this plate and seal aside. I'm gonna try and get this spinny fan thing out. What we need is a pair of uh, rusty pliers. We're gonna squeeze these two little finger hook things right here. See if we can't pull this SOB out. <sighs> okay, this is kind of harder than I thought. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, we got the fan out. We'll set the fan aside. Put our rusty pliers aside. We'll put our face plate back on. Oh, my little screw that back on here. By the way, I get questions about the watch. It's an Armatron Diamond. Nothing special. It is water resistant, waterproof, whatever. Still comes down the spiral. So the fan is just a gimmick. So what makes it spiral? Well, let's take a look here again. It must, must be the plate. Gotta be the plate. If we take a look at the plate here. I don't know how well you're going to be able to see it on camera. Probably not going to want to focus. But, if you look very, very closely, it looks like the holes are in there at an angle. Every single one of them. And on this side, the front, they're not. So, the water's going in, hitting an angle, and coming out the front. So, if I turn this plate around, we should get straight water. If my theory is correct. Yeah, let's do that. Let's pop this out. Take this seal. Turn the plate around. Put the seal back. We'll screw it back on. Now, if my theory is correct, we should get straight water. Not insinuating the sexual preference of the water here. <laughs> yes. That's it. That is why it spins. Because the holes on one side of the plate, or the holes are drilled at an angle. With the little, ch you can see kind of that they look a little bigger on this side than they do on this side. So it's actually like a little angle chamfer into the holes. Anybody that doesn't know what a chamfer is, it's a it's an edge break on a hole. Anybody that doesn't know what an edge break is, is... Uh, anyways, we're going to spin this plate back around. Put the correct side 
facing towards the inside of the shower head. Put the seal back in. Was still going to leave the fan out. Screw the head back on. Turn the water on. Spiral. Okay. Well, there you go. That's how it works. Now, I don't know. Those are little bitty holes. They must have a fast machine that does it. But. And uh, just for entertainment purposes, put the fan back in. I'll turn the plate around back to the wrong side. Put the seal back in. Put the cap back on just to uh, eliminate the fan causing the spin. Great water. There you go. It is the way the holes are machined into the plate. Thank you guys very much. Uh, like and subscribe if you can, please. I'd really appreciate it. You guys have a good day. Thank you.